Okay guys, I'm gonna use the old plot on this deck to get the sweep. As soon as I sweep him over, I'm gonna keep my legs in a certain configuration. It's gonna allow my body to fold forward and that's gonna cause um, like a slicer, a bicep slicer using my shin, okay? So just to kind of give you the overview. So we're talking about, we've already got the slow motion. He rolls over, I have all the control, but he rolls over and I'm, I'm opening all this up so you can see, right? Of course you wanna be as tight as possible and you wanna be able to keep your knee now on the outside, all right? So I'm gonna to transition to this fast and strong and everything during the fight. I just want you to see what I'm doing. So I open up my knee, I open, move my butt a little bit, and now my stomach is gonna fold over that. The shin bone is gonna cause a lot of damage on that bicep. So go slow on your friends, right? And then I'm looking for a good side control. You know, you could hug different ways. I don't want him to escape in any way. I don't want him to get this arm out. That's my main concern. Once I lay, lay forward, my hips go in and I start to pull my knee back. So look at how my stomach, okay? Look how my stomach is keeping his arm in play. He can't get his arm out. If he puts it out here, it's all good, but he can't bring it this way. So now I'm gonna start to pull my knee back. So once I'm here, I fold my body forward, making sure that his arm stays in between my stomach and my leg there. And now you can see that my left foot starts to move. And I'm gonna get the bicep. So let's go back to the beginning where I have the omoplata, right? And I'm controlling maybe very tight. Now I see that he's going for the roll. And so as he goes for the roll, I made a little control there for a second with my wrist. I started leaning forward early and being just loose enough with my body, my hip, my knee to open up. Because you gotta remember your knee was here. And this is soft right here. This, this doesn't really hurt his arm, right? So I need to be able to get there. See how I did that? I used the pressure on my back ankle. And as I put my hands here, So then I can get the bicep slicer. It's gonna be painful, right? So don't go, don't go um, too hard. I was gonna show you one more time. So I get into the omoplata. I'm in the guard. Let's start anywhere. Let's start anywhere. So I'm in the guard. Boom, you do your thing, you hip out. Maybe it's the classic one where you're able to start going here. And right now he starts rolling already. Look how I start transitioning immediately. Bicep slicer off of the omoplata. 